Do you often look at the sky? Yes, I frequently look at the sky. In the morning when I go out, I do check the weather by having a look at the sky. And of course, at night time also, I love to enjoy the view of the stars and the moon. Do you see the moon and stars at night where you live? Yes, I do. Actually, I'm in the habit of getting onto the terrace after having dinner. And during this time, I have a perfect view of the stars and the moons. Do you prefer the sky at night or the sky in the morning? I prefer both because I love to observe the nature no matter in what form it is. But still, I give more preference to observe the stars and the moon at night as they are far more captivating. Is there a good place where you live to look at the sky? Well, I don't think that there is any special or designated place in my area to observe the stars or the sky. Generally, people get onto the terrace of their homes and then they observe it. What kinds of advertisements do you watch? To be very honest, uh, I cannot choose advertisement I watch because when I watch my favorite TV show or any sports match, uh, they just appear randomly. So it's uh, very much whatsoever come I have to watch. Where can you see the advertisements? We see advertisement almost everywhere when we watch TV, when we listen to radio, when we use internet, advertisement keep on uh, coming or appearing and then on even on the roads we see the billboards in the newspaper so there are varied sources for advertisement have you ever bought something due to advertisement yes i can say that uh, i am always under the influence of advertisement and i have purchased many things for example i often purchase accessories footwears in fact last month only i purchased a new smartphone because of the influence of an advertisement do you watch ads from start to the end? Actually, it depends on the kind of the advertisement. If it is really interesting and captivating, I do watch it from the beginning till the end and over and over. But most of the time, advertisements can be quite boring and irritating and I often skip them. What kind of exercise do people in your country like? People do various type of exercises in my country, but it generally depends on the age group they are in. For example, young children prefer to take part in games or sports, team sports especially. Mature people go for gyms and uh, other health centers, but old people only prefer going for a walk or doing yoga. What characteristics do you think an athlete should have? Athletes should have uh, lots of characteristics to be successful in the field of sports. They have to be dedicated, they have to be hardworking, they must not give up and most important thing is their fitness for which they must uh, sincere efforts and uh, they must develop endurance and stamina by doing a lot of exercise. What, why are there so few top athletes? Uh, that's uh, really a serious issue that the number of top athletes is very small and the main reason is that there are so few people who are competent at that level. They not only have physical stamina but they have a very controlled mind. Uh, they have controlled mind as well which is equally important to be good in the field of sports and this is I think is the main reason and another reason can be that uh, they constantly keep on improving their performance and that's the reason why there are few top athletes. What is the best way to become a great athlete? Um, well, uh, what I personally believe a person must take professional training and must uh, participate in competition at all different levels no matter international or national because uh, with this they by defeating because by defeating the rivals or their competence they can improve their own abilities and one day they can become one of the greatest athletes